Okay, so we're gonna do the build video. It's gonna be like a quick time lapse thing. I've got the tools I think I need. I'm um, just having a look in this instruction manual. Uh, it looks really, really simple um, to do. So, blah, blah, blah. Okay, so for this um, tutorial, um, to assemble the fly beam, you're gonna need limited amount of tools. I believe it's simply gonna be um, a Phillips screwdriver, some glue, pair of pliers and a small screwdriver. Those are the tools I think you're gonna need. So um, I'm just gonna follow the uh, manual through. It's just gonna be like a quick time lapse. Uh, of course, if you do enjoy the video, please remember to hit a thumbs up. And of course, if it's the first time you see my face on your screen, please remember to hit the red subscribe button. Okay, so let's get to it. And that guys is done. It took me 
about 35 minutes or so. Obviously, I uh, haven't installed the uh, transmitter, I've just put the wings on there just purely so that it sort of holds things together just while it finishes off drying. Um, but really guys, such an easy plane to in, uh, assemble. It literally just fell together. It's probably the easiest one I've done from Hobby King. Really, really impressed with it. Um, as I said in the out of boxing video, loads and loads of the um, assemblies already be done for us. Like they've already put the decals on, they've already installed servos, they've already routed the wires for the lights. So really, really simple. Very, 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 very good instructions, guys. They're all in full English and they're all coloured. Very, very easy to understand. Really, really impressed. Um, so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to leave this one to dry. I'm not going to fly it today. Uh, I need to get hold of a suitable transmitter for it as well. So I'm not going to fly it today. I'm just going to leave it up in the room just to dry. Let all the glue harden, and then by the time we fly, it'll be, be it'll be all set and ready to go. So really, really excited about it. Really, really nice looking plates. And of course, please remember to leave a like on the video. Uh, post some comments down in the comment section below what you're thinking of this one and of course go check out Hobby King who made this magic happen. So thanks very much guys, thanks Hobby King for sending it to me and hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, please remember to smash that like button uh, if you did. Cheers guys and we'll see you in the next video.